Okay, I'm not weird. Please, please, I'm not. I'm not weird. Come back. Ah, come. No, either name. Thanks. Sit down. Sit down. First of all, I want to apologize for not posting a video last week. I was sick, but here we are now. Here we are now. Here we are now. Hello. Hello. Um, it's your girl, Bahra Habuta, in the building. Welcome. Welcome. When we say we're going to do our hair, it is a day's affair. Do not make plans with me for the rest of the day because I will not be available. In fact, when I go to the salon, it's from nine to five. Don't catch feelings. Don't don't think I'm trying to sky even any other plans. Nah, it's just that I'm action. I'm dead ass doing my hair for the whole day. Dramatic is actually an understatement. So why am I fidgeting? Sorry, it's because I'm tired of standing in one spot. Ah, wait, let me just list out. You know that two weeks, there's probably like a couple, let's say two or a week, a week or two, where you're deciding what hairstyle you want to do. And you're out here researching and you're walking the streets, you're looking at people's hair, you're like, mm, that looks nice. You're looking at how it's complimenting her complexion, you're like, oh, I can actually pull that off because I think we're like the same. You know what I'm saying? And then you plan for this hairstyle. And if you're like me, you let people know what hairstyle you're going to do. And even when the weekend comes, because first of all, going back to point number one, people know that I'm doing my hair for the whole day. So Monday I'm coming on new person and as I've told you guys this whole week I'm coming back with brown hair. This is Mahura in the morning on her way to the salon. And then you go to the braid store and you know which color you're going to buy. You know this one, this one, number 30. You're looking for the braids, you know. You look the first row, okay, not there. Second row. Alright, not here. Let me call for assistance. Excuse me. Uh gonna braids there number 30. Apana, I is a Zilisha. Guy, I have to Oh, I have to What you got, twenty-seven? What you gonna do? What you gonna do? You go to school on Monday and you're like, mm -mm, uh, you know what happened? But I tried calling you. I tried calling you. They didn't have number thirty, so I just have to do this one. I'll do it next time. I'll do it next time. Last summer when I went for my internship, okay, maybe I may have pushed the buttons a bit because I changed my hairstyle like three times, and that internship, internship, that internship was five weeks long. Is it real? Is it yours? Yeah, it's mine. See, I bought it. Who else did it before if I bought it? <laughs> when you purchase an item, it becomes yours. So... Oh, you're not even that black. You're so pretty for a black girl. You're so pretty for an African. I can't just be gorgeous on its own. I have to be gorgeous for my lace. A human being actually told me I look like Rihanna. Do me a favor, please. Get out of here. First of all, first of all, let me make one thing, a couple of things clear. If I look like Rihanna, you think your one would be telling me when I'm 20 years old for the first time that I look like Rihanna? I said thank you, but that day, a little bit of my soul was left in that spot. I've even been told I look like Halle Berry. Hall what? Halle who? Halle, Halle what? Is there another Halle? Maybe there's another Halle Berry I've never seen. You know, you don't know. At the same time, I sort of understand where people are coming from and I low-key kind of take it as a compliment. Because there are some people who've never seen except on TV. So that's how, what they're comparing you to. And they're like, oh, she's pretty. Just like the person that I saw on TV that looks like this. Our hair is different. Yes, serious. We don't need to wash it every day because we will be stripping it of its nutrients. And if other people want to wash every day, that's cool. If you want to wash one a week, if you don't want to wash it, you is nasty. Excuse me, there's a difference. Hey, let's not say we don't wash. Where? If you don't wash, where? Excuse, where? 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 You. Talking to you. Talking to you. You is nasty. You're nasty. You is nasty. Okay, so fun fact. I'm not a diehard lover of meat. In fact, you told me at you. Well, there's no more meat from now on. <coughs> Guys, it's like when I coughed, it went to my story. <laughs> for a lot of, no, a lot. I'm like, for the end of like, from like year 11, IB1 and IB2, first year, 
I was veg pescatarian, like I kept moving back and forth. But the meat that I would add into my diet when I was pescatarian, I'm not sure if it's pescatarian, you just know I was veg, I was not eating no meat. If at most I really want some meat, then I'd have to now. Now I know what you're wondering, why are you telling us this story? I'm telling you this story because when I tell human beings <laughs> that I'm veg or I'm pes uh, that I'm veg or I don't eat meat. Let me tell you the irony of this story that I've just realized as I was saying it, but it's actually a struggle from within. <laughs> I was gonna say that it's a struggle from other, but I've just realized it's just from and other than. Yeah, so we'll just end that point here. Hair shrinkage. Hair shrinkage. It just annoys me, like when you're walking in the streets, you know what I'm saying? And then your hair has shrunk but people don't know your full potential you know that's the issue the fact that people are just out here not knowing what is actually going on in within you know within they don't know how far your as much because there are some people i'm not gonna lie their hair will be this short but when they stretch it's reaching here and i wish i was exaggerating i wish i was exaggerating it's not me in particular let me tell this one this is my full potential yeah, that's, that's all you get. What you see is what you get. People who just think we were born, like we came out of the womb. <laughs> Talking, you know what I'm saying? It didn't happen like that. It's not something that's innate. I'm not gonna lie. Probably I can, I can take him out. You guys have seen my dance moves. Don't lie. Don't lie. Don't lie. Hey, you, you've seen. You've seen my. You've not seen my potential. You've seen my potential. You know. You see. You've seen what I'm working with. Thank you very much for watching this video. We will see you next week, same time, same place. If you're interested in a more intimate interaction with me, myself, and I, you can follow me on my social medias. That is Wahula Kamuda on Snapchat, Instagram, and Twitter. If you're not interested in such an intimate relationship, don't worry. Just keep it clean, keep it simple here on YouTube. Subscribe and comment and say. One. Apologies for the bell. Apologies for the bell. Hey, when this bell is going to ring up, bitch. It is Easter. Easter just finished. Easter just finished. That means that Jesus rose again. And for those who are believers, then it is a beautiful thing to be experiencing this thing with me. It means also for those Catholicians as well that the Lent is over, the Lent is over. You can do now what you want to do. But that does not include any extra curricular activities such as mother stealing and the bad behaviors that you people do outside in the public, but quietly, it was your parents. <clears throat> Even until here, you sing watching. That's crazy. That's wild. But thank you very much for watching this video. Until here, we will see you some other time. Bye, people. I love you. Bye.